Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. So we're checking out Mike Evans versus Marshawn Lattimore, huge fight. This was recommended to me in my Discord server. Thank you so much. This happens like a week or so ago, I think. I think like a, a fight breaks out, obviously between two people. So we're just gonna see what my reaction is. I haven't seen it obviously. So uh, let me know what you guys think about this fight down below. Let me know who you think was in the wrong. I guess I'll tell you my opinion when I watch it, but yeah, let me know down below. Let's watch it. It's only like four minutes, so just a short one today. Let's have a look. Pushes him all the way to the boundary. Now we got a fight on the field. Whoa. The police. Mike Evans just punched a guy, and now the Wait. benches have cleared. Dad. Trying to hold guys back off the sideline. Wow. Everyone's there. I need to see what happened. I didn't well, even we see told what you these happened. teams have been super chatty in their matchups the last couple of years. I can't even see what's going on. It's, it's just still like a big going pile in there. Of bodies. Yeah, that wasn't your typical. Oh, look, I mean, there was punches thrown. Other. That wasn't your typical. Did, post, did he just grab his neck? Post Dan. whistle scuffle. This was, this was pretty heated. And they got through. This got to be a replay, hey. Let's replay. see how this started. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. It's Brady and Marshawn Lattimore, and then Fournette gets involved. Yeah, Fournette. Oh, and then Mike Evans came and he. It's hard to even see what's yeah, see, going Evans on. see, Evans came here. off and he just rocked Lattimore. I would be surprised flag. to see some guys thrown out of this one here, KB. Yeah, New York can get involved oh, and make shoot. decisions here. We told you earlier about Lattimore and Evans. They really don't like each other. They've had issues in the past. And that is really what got this going. And then Evans came on to heat it up. Flags everywhere. Yeah, the flags going crazy. Boy, oh boy, what a mess. Wow. I don't, I still don't even really know what under, I still don't really understand what's going on. Look at that guy in the background. <laughs> Mike Pereira, there's a lot to sort out here for these officials. Tell me what you're seeing. See flags hit the ground in this situation. New York can automatically get involved. Not just who was called for the foul, but whoever else participates in the fight. And then but they can eject involved, those right? players. Now you heard Sean Hockley say both teams go to the sideline. And, that, and so then the officials are going to meet, talk to New York. May take them a while to get this whole thing settled. They're all going to offset, by the way. I don't care how many fouls They're end up getting called against each team. Fouls on each team. Oh, number are they going to list them out? New Orleans and number 13 for Tampa Bay. Both number 23 and number 13 have been disqualified from the game. Just two people. Those fouls offset. It's fourth down. Evans and Lattimore. So Mike Evans and Marshawn Lattimore are both ejected. And really their beef is at the heat of this fight. Yeah, we've seen this kind of, this pot's been boiling the entire game. You've seen Lattimore well, up in like Evans' Lattimore face the entire the day, shadowing him. Evans is, of course, frustrated. Oh, no, he you know, pushed. We've, we've seen Mike Evans do this before. He pushed as James well. Jameis' time right, in Tampa. Right, right, right. Remember that time Evans came off and came in defense of Jameis. They're not scared to come come to their quarterback's aid. You know, and there's also the fact that the Saints, you know, they're not afraid of this Bucks offense, right? I mean, Lattimore obviously chirping to Brady. That's what started it up. And now you wonder from a football side. That's been the big matchup today. So with the top quarterback and the top wide receiver out, who gets the advantage? I don't know. I think right now you'd have to imagine that Dang. it's still, it's still, in, you know, Benefits New Orleans because if you're if you're the Bucks, who, who's left, right? You came in without Julio. You came in without Chris Godwin. I mean, you're, you're starting to run out of bodies right now. Scotty Miller, Russell Gage. These guys are going to have to step yep, up here in the fourth was quarter. Missing, wasn't it? It's really all they got before missing. that. Remember, it was Lattimore with the great coverage to force this punt. And then Short straight back into punt, it. Out of bounds, and the Saints are going to get great field position. Well, as if the atmosphere wasn't charged up enough. Right yeah, holy, holy! Not too bad, not too bad. But it, w it was pretty crazy that the whole bench came off, or the whole bench cleared onto the field. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty intense. 
I feel like at that moment as the ref it's like you have to you, you have to try to get it under control very quickly otherwise it can get out of hand very quickly too um yeah it was hard to really know what was going on there because I think there were like four people at the start kind of tussling so it was kind of hard to hard, for me it was hard to see like who but I guess the main culprits I guess we know it was Evans and Lattimore because of the title but yeah not not too bad of a fight not too bad of a fight that's um not cringeworthy for me sometimes I cringe a little bit on in fights on the sports field because I think sometimes it's just unnecessary just get on with the game type thing everyone has a different opinion on that but um, I get it it's the emotions things like that but yeah sometimes I cringe a little bit but that wasn't that wasn't too cringeworthy it was just a little bit of rough and tumbles a little bit of shit talk I assume um, but they did get sent off in the end because I guess rules are rules no fighting and they did clear benches so that's a pretty big deal <laughs> like that's a pretty big deal could have been bad it could have been really really bad but yeah that's, that's an exciting moment i hope you guys are enjoying the football season so far i'm looking forward to seeing how it goes if you guys didn't know my team is the dolphins and we're two for two at the moment so i'm very very happy about that wish us luck you guys <laughs> wish us luck in the season <laughs> Holy moly, guys, thank you so, so much for watching today. Again, I hope you guys are enjoying the football season so far. I love seeing the updates on the Discord. So if you guys haven't joined the Discord, by the way, I'll link it down below. We have many different chats on there. History chats, sport chats, Twitch chats. Um funny funny chat oh all sorts of all sorts of different subjects on there so if you want to come check it out just click the link down below um and if you don't like it you don't have to stay you can just leave it's no big deal um but it's fun it's a fun little community over there so feel free to come over there um but yeah guys thank you so so much for watching today's video i really do appreciate you hanging out with me tonight or today or this morning whatever time that you're watching this but yeah catch you guys in the next video bye guys Tell me what I want, just keep searching on It's never enough, I'll come back to call Run after blood, I wouldn't get one if I could find a fire